Hey everyone, yo man Jonah Campbell is here, and today, there's something super important that I need to share with you today. I already announced this in a community post that was created back in September when I returned to YouTube, but it didn't get a whole lot of comments, so that's why I'm now making this announcement in a video. Here's what I wanted to talk to you guys about. So guys. Do you remember the app known as Wombo.ai? Well, I found out a few months ago that for some really odd, bizarre and unknown reason, the Wombo.ai app is no longer available in the Apple App Store. Now, some of you are probably wondering, what's Wombo.ai? Well guys, I'll explain to you what it is and how it works. So, Wombo.ai is a Canadian image manipulation mobile app released in 2021 that used to be available in the Apple App Store, available to install onto people's iPhones. It used a provided selfie to create a deep fake of a person lip synced to one of various famous and or popular songs. How it worked was that somebody took a picture of someone, whether a real life person or a fictional character, and imported them into the app so that they could sing a famous and or popular song. The app was commonly used on YouTube and Twitter to earn views and have fun with friends. Or, if you were in the Vyond community, the app was used to make fun of severely hated users such as me, Christmas Yes Sunny Dano, Jay Kaiser, Emmanuel Thomas, Wilson Perez, Chase the Stick Figure, and many other Vyonders that I'm friends with in the community. Well guys, I found out that as of May 2022, the Wombo.ai app was suddenly removed from the Apple App Store for unknown reasons. I don't know why it got removed, but it's indeed really sad. I remember having a lot of fun with that app, and I really enjoyed making singing videos by using it. And now that it's gone from the Apple App Store, I can no longer get it to open on my iPhone, so I'm afraid I had no other choice but to delete it. So now this means I can no longer make singing videos using Wombo.ai for iOS. However, I've got good news. I realize that I still have some unpublished Wombo.ai singing videos left over that I found in my video archives. So therefore, I will most likely be able to post Wombo.ai singing videos onto both YouTube and Twitter, even though the Wombo.ai app is no longer available in the Apple App Store. So in a way, Wombo.ai is still being used on social media and other parts of the internet with the help of posthumous videos that were created before the Wombo.ai app was removed from the Apple App Store. So it's a good thing we have stuff like unreleased videos, archives, and other unused content. It can really make a posthumous release all the more beautiful. Don't you all agree with me? Well guys, this is all I'd like to say for this video. I hope you learned some very important and exciting information. Until next time, this is yo man Jonah Campbell, signing off for now. Bye everyone. Merry Christmas, and a Happy New Year.